Visco. Hi everyone, welcome back to Visco channel. Today I'm going to teach how to enable Internet Explorer extension tab in Google Chrome and Microsoft Edge to access web GUI for HIK IP devices such as camera. The reason for this video is because there are older IP devices that require to use Internet Explorer to enter the web GUI. For this video, I'm going to use this mode of camera as an example. As you can see, I cannot enter the web GUI via Google Chrome, so I need to add IE tab into my Google Chrome. So you need to search IE tab in your Google, click add to Chrome, and then it will show a new page called IE tab documentation. From the documentation, you need to click IE tab helper on the left side, and then click the highlighted blue word for IE tab helper. It will download a wizard. After that, run the wizard and install it. After done installing, go to this extension icon right here and pin the IE tab so that it will show IE icon besides the extension icon. Then click the IE icon, it will show something like this. Need to note that IE tab for Google Chrome is only for free for two weeks upon installing. Then you can try to enter the web GUI again. So now it works. Now let's try for Microsoft Edge. For Microsoft Edge, it's a lot easier compared to Google Chrome. Same as just now, I cannot enter the web GUI via Microsoft Edge. It will tell me your browser is not supported. Need to use IE. So to enable IE tab, need to click the three dots option at top right corner right here to enter the settings of Microsoft Edge. So in the setting, just search for Internet Explorer and look for IE compatibility. You need to make sure the IE mode is allowed, not in default mode. And click Restart. After Restart, you need to add a page you want to set for IE tab. So in this case, I enter my IP camera's web URL because I want to access my IP cap camera web GUI. After that, you can try to enter to the IP camera's web GUI already. So as you can see, I can access to my web GUI using the IE tab. So if you want to use IE tab, it is suggested to use Microsoft Edge because it's free and easier to configure. So that is all for today's video. Hope you guys enjoy and learn something from it. Thank you for watching. Visco. Thank <laughs> you.